Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Alex Kazora. I began the week talking about the Pittsburgh Steelers' run defense, and I'm ending the week talking about the Pittsburgh Steelers' run defense. The same story that applied last week, can Pittsburgh stop the run, applies this week to the Carolina Panthers. No, they're not viewed in the same light as the Ravens or Browns or Eagles and Bears, but they are a run-first team. If they're going to win, that's how they're going to do it. Run the ball. Interim head coach Steve Wilkes has made that clear, and the Panthers routinely bring out six, seven, even eight offense alignment at the same time the latter affectionately called their Arby's package for having, quote, the meats. So, is Pittsburgh going to bounce back? Run defense can and is technical. Hand placement, leverage, and it's schematic as well. Run fits and assignment. But it comes down to one word. Pride. Where is the Steelers' pride? Will they get off the mat and play some run defense like Pittsburgh's been known to for the last 50 years? Currently, they are not meeting that mark. To win this game, to avoid Mike Tomlin's first losing season, they need to dig deep, man up, and stop the run. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with myself and Dave Bryan every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.